Hello, wherever you happen to be, welcome to Catalonia, welcome to Barcelona. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player, Stuart Robson. And we're focusing on, technically speaking, one of the best leagues in the world. I'm talking, of course, about La Liga. It's Barcelona, and they face Cadiz. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Well, this is what we think for Barcelona. Mark andre Ter Stegen starts in goal. Frenkie de Jong plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. And leading the attack today is Robert Lewandowski. And the contest begins. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. Not possibilities inside the box. And the ball is loose. And holding on to it at the second time of asking. And the timing was perfect. Ball one. Rafinha, and he takes on the shot. No problems for the keeper. And he's lost custody of the ball here. Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. Losing possession here. So this could pose problems for the defenders. And good work to deny the chance. <laughs> Who's going to get on the end of it? It's still dangerous. <laughs> And a big chance at that, Derek. He should have put them in the driving seat there. Being pressed hard. And well, it's gone out of play under real duress. Araujo Lewandowski and they continue to advance and a lot of options here making sure nothing untoward happened very quick thinking there well, can they be creative from here Oh, this is looking promising. Oh, could be. And a wonderful diving save to deny the opportunity. He's driven in the corner. Oh, just the kind of save every goalkeeper would expect to make. Teammates available. Intercepting it intelligently. There will be one minute added on at the end.
Well, the first 45 minutes have come and gone here in Catalonia. And now they get the ball rolling. And good work to deny the chance. Oh, this is looking promising. Oh, could be. And a wonderful diving save to deny the opportunity. So back underway here into the second half. Not the pass he had in mind. Now can they counter clinically? Well, it fizzled out. De Jong Rafinha now with De Jong Pedri Frankie De Jong keeping it moving dynamically and just like that they don't have the ball anymore Alex Fernandez a move of promise on the flank and it's played into the centre can he put them in front Yes is the emphatic answer, and you have to say it was on the cards. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging someone to get on the end of it, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. Barcelona restart the game. Will that goal have the effect of stinging them into action? He's found a pocket of space. Oh, fancy footwork. Well, I'm afraid it goes down as a wasted opportunity. Well, no excuses. He should have scored there, and the goalkeeper got really lucky. He can't believe it. Well, not covering himself in glory defensively. Body in the way. Just 20 minutes remaining now. And he could really get at the opposition. A gift for any goalkeeper. Well, as you can see, Barcelona have had most of the ball, but their attacking play has been too slow, mainly due to a lack of movement of the front players. At some point, they have to threaten the space in behind the defenders, otherwise they're going to lose this. Indeed, and first they have to win back possession. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Pedri. And showing fine vision. Lewandowski, this could level it. Closing down well. It comes to nothing in the end. De Jong. Well, he stopped them in their tracks. Time against Barcelona. But you can't count them out. Determined defending. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Alex Fernandez. 
And the referee brings this match to an end. Not to be for Barcelona. They've lost this game. What did you make of it? Well, Derek, it was a poor result, but it was a really tight contest. Both sides had their chances. Could have gone either way. But in the end, they will be disappointed. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, I enjoyed watching him today. His work rate...